A man once stated, God gives his strongest warriors his hardest battles. But I think when it comes to the ever-growing species of Karen, hospitality and retail staff would certainly disagree. So in the spirit of combat, we've got the best and closest battlefield footage this week of an enemy that needs no introduction. Keep your helmets on and remember to subscribe to Unluggy. Instead of apologizing and gracefully reversing back down the one-way street, she went the wrong way down, you won't believe what this racist Karen does instead. Dead. Cool. Hi. You want to be racist? You want to be racist? Go ahead. Go. Go. What do I want? Oh my god, that's perfect. Is there anything that this Karen won't try to blame someone else for in this clip? We can certainly see where this mom's priorities are, and so can the cop that gets called. Up next, we've got a Karen who thinks she's so entitled that she's allowed to say her opinion on what bathroom a trans woman should use. Hey Karen, no one asked. When we've got to go, we've got to go. You're denying my friend access to the bathroom, right? Why am I not able to use a bathroom? Why? Because she's a woman. Don't you realize I'm a woman? How dare you? I'm wearing high heels. I'm wearing a. I think after this drunk meltdown, this Karen certainly doesn't have to worry about flying anywhere. When you wake up, you won't remember. You won't remember none of it. I will remember. No, you won't. How about you on the bed? Do you love God? Would you die for God? God right now? How did you get out of here? You're making a scene. I'm making a scene because the government controls everything. It's not God. It ain't God no more. It's the government. I don't care. I'll die. I would die for God. Because guess what? 
Come them boys. Yeah, here come them boys. Now you in trouble. Uh-huh. I'm trying to go to Tampa. Okay, well, I'm trying to go to Tampa to see my grandpa. She took up the computer at the man. He died. Wait, 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 wait. I'm sure when this guy woke up this morning, the last thing he expected was to be followed by this racist Karen, and definitely not what she said when he confronted him. Go ahead. Go ahead. What'd you like to call me? What did you call me? It's not illegal what did you to call, call you a What did you call me? Our next clip is a battle between two male Karens, fighting it out with a war of words. But who wins? Take a look. Crazy, bro. No, I'm for not no crazy. Reason. If you want to see crazy, no I'll be crazy. For no reason, bro. So like no I said, reason. I was sitting right there. For I was no right reason, like when the young lady was right for on no me. For no reason, bro. Get your it's stuff. It's called social distancing. Get your stuff. You need Get to your understand. Stuff. Get your stuff, bro. Because you're sounding crazy. Get away from me. How about that? Get, Get away, away from, from you. Get away from you before I call the cops on you. Call the cops. Uh -huh. call Don't try to play one with me. Call them. Don't try to play one with me. Call them. I'm a different veteran. Call them. And? Call them. Am I supposed to get them? Call them. Don't try to play I'm, one I'm from ETSD, boy. I don't care. I'm from New Jersey. Call them, boy. I'm from New Jersey. And I'm from New York. What that mean? That don't mean nothing to me. All right, then shut up with it. I'm from the hood. Don't try to play one with you me. Ain't no damn hood. You are allowed to sack of crap. Man, go ahead and get your shit and go. Go to, go to Jersey City and New York. I know how it is on the go street. Go ahead and get your shit and go. Don't try to tell me Man, what to you, do. You get man, away from I don't me. Hear that get your shit and go. Don't try to tell me what to do. Man, get your stuff and go. You get your stuff and get up out of here. Don't try to tell me what to do. I was here first. Man, shut up. Here we have another specimen of a male Karen who just won't wait his turn to be served. Who's going to tell him that in order to get what you want, manners go a long way? I'm talking like that. I like that. Never give my money back. Never give my money back. Talk to you like that. I don't care. Where's my money at? Hurry up. I gotta go. I ain't got time for you. Waiting on you. Well, sorry. Should have thought about that for you. Hurry up. This male Karen cop seems to be enjoying his power a little too much over this Uber driver. Their motto is to serve and protect, not scream and abuse. Sir, you understand I, me? Sir, I am not saying Do you understand me? Yes, I understand. Okay, so stop it with your mouth. Okay. Stop it with your for what, sir? For okay. what, sir? Okay. Stop it with that bull okay. and realize the three vehicle and traffic law violations you committed. Okay. Okay? Do you understand me? Yes, I, I don't understand. know what planet you think I'm you're not, on right now I'm, I'm not planning sir i'm here planning i said planet i say i'm I said not planet. Any, yeah i'm not I'm any planet this sucks sorry about that pick the wrong guy i'll get obviously pull over five feet do you understand me pull over <laughs> i have this on video in case you want to you have yeah okay thank you so much in case you need to submit it to yeah. someone Thank you so much. Yeah, send me your email. I'll send it to you. Okay. I'll, I'll give you my card. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. No, that's crazy. That's, that's really that's inappropriate. That's abuse of power, obviously. Because he was there. No, it's, uh, it's no, not your fault. Lincoln Listen, was, it's not your fault. Like, yeah. It's... Uh, this guy's just a... Yeah. <laughs> to put it mildly. I mean, you shouldn't be slamming your car, or he shouldn't be slamming your car door, he shouldn't be throwing things around. He doesn't have a right to open your door, like, he's, he's... I don't think he could have really arrested you, I don't You weren't under arrest, I think he's just on, on a power trip right now. Yeah, because you honked at him. Because you honked. Because he, he didn't have a blinker on. No. I mean, if you're gonna park, you're supposed to put your blinker on. That's the way this works. That's why I'm saying. No, no, I know. Yeah, but you know, I know. I would I know. just not say anything. Don't say anything. 
Just, just. You're gonna be. It. Yes, sir. I'm sorry, sir. That's it. Now let me tell you something. The next time you do it again, okay. You're getting. Your... Okay, what? You gonna let me finish? Stop. I'm... Stop interrupting me. Okay. Apologize. I'm sorry. Well, who do you think you're talking to here? Sir, I'm not saying nothing. I said, no, I every time I open my mouth, you have something to say. When you're driving up my when I'm trying to park the car, and then you have to do something with your hands. Sir, I just say... I don't okay. care what you okay. have to say. Okay. Do you understand that? Yeah, I understand. People are allowed to park in this car, okay. park their cars okay. on the side of the street without your interference. Okay, and then your opinion about what's going on. Okay, sir. Okay? Apologize. Especially when the person you're doing it to are the police. Okay, sir. I don't know where you where you're coming from, or where you think the you're appropriate in doing that. Okay. That doesn't it's not the way it works. Okay, sir. How long have you been in this country? Almost two years. Almost how long? Two years. Two years. I got news for you. And use this lesson. Remember this in the future. Don't ever do that again. Okay. The only reason you're not in handcuffs going to jail and getting summages in the precinct is because I have things to do. Okay. That's the only reason that's not happening. Because this isn't important enough for me. You're not important enough. Don't ever do that again. Do you? Are you a fair? Yes. You're a fair? Yes. And this guy is taking time out of your day for his vehicle and traffic violations. Sure. Thank you. Can you take that his plate number, please? I have his plate. Oh, thank you so much. Okay. Imagine being so entitled that you think you can not only interrupt a total stranger's meal, but spout ignorant, racist remarks. No one would do that, right? Wrong. This racist male Karen certainly did. Wait, have you had a light well fry before? What is a light well fry? Okay, it's you guys filming yourself eating? Yeah. You're weird, almost. Yeah. <laughs> Why me, man? Why me? I just want to eat my fine Dutchman in peace, bro. <laughs> I feel like this is a fever dream. Like, is it still the 24th? Is it still Christmas Eve? It's because I'm ethnic. Honestly, for eating this flying Dutchman, I kind of feel like I deserve to be a crime. Well, that actually happened. <laughs> that really did it actually just happen. Japanese or Korean? Uh, I'm Korean. Yeah, you're Korean. Uh, Kim Jong Un's boyfriend. You're Kim Jong Un's boyfriend? You know, we have been acquainted. You've had gay sex with him. Ooh, would not go that far. We're only on second base. He hasn't taken me out to dinner yet. <laughs> Can I take you out to dinner? Come on, stop, stop, stop. Nothing, nothing. Stop. I'm, you sorry. Say I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. My bad. I didn't say anything. You didn't say anything. No, sir. I'm like it's spit in your face and it's a Filipino. It's a Filipino. Why are you acting like that? Dude, we can get assaulted. <laughs> oh my god, only in San Ramon. I thought we were having like. No, you weren't. Really? Anyway, um, you can try the. Anyway, you can try the fry. Hmm. Hey, you good? I'm chilling, don't worry. This is not in the name of the holiday cheer. Yeah, somebody was not included <laughs> in all the reindeer games. You should have not said Sorry, anything. I can't, I can't. He's staring at us right now. <laughs> Anyways, what little fries? I would love one. He's still there, isn't he? He is very much still there. <laughs> oh. At least I'll try the root beer float. Hmm. That is. Hey, Rupert, you think he's gonna pull a gun on? My midterms are almost being released. I'm, I'm just saying. I'm just... Um, honestly, 10 out of 10 would get it again. Oh my god, I can't even do this. I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. Um, so I'm gonna try the whole grilled onion and see if it's You sound so nervous. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm gonna... Well, yeah, because he's like, I'm gonna wait for you out. I was eating the paper. Wow. Also, fine Dutchman is no, mo no more, no more. Mm, yeah, I can't speak. I can't speak. I can't speak. <laughs> rare laps and uh... Dude, that has genuinely never happened to me before. Take a look at this racist Karen's freakout at a supposedly stolen package by her mailman. But make sure to keep watching. You won't believe what happens at the end. I am not happy! I'm tempted to check your pockets! In fact, I'm calling the police!
place. You can call who you like to call, ma'am, but I gotta go. No, you're not going anywhere. You're not going anywhere. You know this lady? You are not going you anywhere. You might want to get this lady. You know her? She just signed that package and spoke what she got it already. Okay, well, I didn't you take the package. Well, I didn't it's take the package. Fetch. She needs to call not fetch not and deal with not fetch, not fetch but she's not going to threaten me and she's not going to hit me. And if she touch me, I'm going to knock her out. I'm just letting you know. I taken a picture of you. You can I take all the you want. I am fetch. filming you right now. Because you are really. I don't really believe already. you. You stole my mala. Don't hit me, ma'am. Don't you hit me. You, you stole hit me. my mala. I never stole anything from I'm you. I'm reporting this to the Landlord. I don't care what you do. Listen, I didn't see anything listen, from you. Everybody in this hallway is here. I really don't care. Everybody matches a bunch of thieves. You need to get you some medication. No, I don't. Oh, yeah, you, you need do. to do your job. I am you definitely 100% reporting you. You stole my jewelry out of this package. Girl, I, I am not happy. Empty your pockets. I'm not emptying nothing. And I have to go. And you have nothing Could to you hide. Just prove it to me. You have nothing to hide. I'm not proving anything to you. Well, not a thing. Actually, you if do. If you touch me, I'm going to knock you out. Over on nine and um, if still you stuff. touch me, I'm going to knock you out. Empty your pockets. I'm not emptying anything, ma'am. Come on. You're being recorded. Come on. You sure are. You, you might want to get her. My stuff. You stole my stuff. Crazy. <laughs> I am reporting you for stealing my package. Do whatever it is you have to do, ma'am. You stole my package. I am definitely reporting this to facts. Why would I steal I your package and give it to you? I agree that I am service and it was empty when I got it. I'm not happy. It was beautiful jewelry and you stole it. You don't need to scream at him. Exactly. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you, follow a report. Why would I give you an empty package if I steal it? Crazy. <laughs> All right, thank you, ma'am. <laughs> I was going to knock her out if she took me. Here we have a classic case of male Karen, who can't understand the concept of patience, especially since he's trying to order food during a lunch rush. I want to talk to your manager. She is my manager. Okay, then get her out here. Sir, we do not have to. Get her out here. Get her out here. You kids don't have to do anything. Yeah, but she's not going to do That's the way you live your life. So we can live, right? That's the way you live your life. No, everybody's got to work. Everybody's got to work, and then everybody's got to live. But you want to relax while you work. That's not right. Sir, I wish you came in about 30 minutes ago and our entire long time. I've seen it when there was a line out the door. I'm sorry, we answer the phone. Well, there's 20 people in here ordering sandwiches. If we answer the phone I've for seen all that. I'm going to cry for you later. I've lived a whole life of that. And I've worked my ass off and I've never complained like you are. And I've never told anyone it couldn't be done or I was too busy to do it, ever. Let it go. <clears throat>